I loved the book when it first came out 10 years ago. I was kind of obsessed with the book and the themes that it was <clears throat> dealing with. Um, you know, the question of how, do, how, does a, how does a man get to the point of being able to justify such a heinous and evil act with, um, in the name of God? How, do, how does that psychological kind of breakdown occur? Um, <clears throat> and, and then when it was, you know, Dustin Lance Black and, you know, Daisy and all these incredible actors, I thought, well, it's a no-brainer and I, I, I would love to be a part of telling the story, being part of this ensemble. And it's an important story. It's a, it's a story about how to, it's a story about how to deal with waking up from um, uh, a kind of an, an illusion of, of thinking that your, that your life had, you know, had a certain meaning, but now is being cracked to the seams. It feels very universal. It was a lot of basketball playing, basketball watching, uh, eating too much um, beef because we're in, in the cow capital of, cow, of, of Canada. Um, great food, I worked out too much, I swam, I went hiking, we did hike trips on, on some weekends, went swimming in lakes, you know, just kind of cleansing, being in the woods, you know, just kind of going, uh, leaving that, leaving work at work, very importantly, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we're on the way to the why, I think it, I think it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, it's not didactic in, in the why, but I think it suggests a lot of the why, it suggests a very, a very patriarchal, uh, religion combined with a kind of egotism of certain men and a kind of um, self-centeredness uh, and a kind of encouraging of that in the culture and enabling of that in the culture that has led to you know potentially good men doing very very bad things you know it's it's uh, it's a really interesting thing to study